In this video, you'll learn how to set up subscriber tracking for your Google Ads. Conversion tracking is critical for feeding data to analytics tools and ad platforms like Google Ads to optimize your ad campaigns. In this tutorial, you'll learn how to set up a Google Tag Manager account, set up a trigger that captures signups, and set up an ad in the Ads Manager. Let's get straight into it. First, we'll be setting up a Google Tag Manager account. Google Tag Manager can help with tracking events and specific user actions like clicks, video plays, downloads, or in this case, subscribes. To get started, go to tagmanager.google.com and make sure you're logged into a Google account. After you're signed in, click on create account and fill out the details on screen. Under account name, add the name of your Beehive publication and select the country you're based in. Now under container setup, add your publication's website URL and for target platform, select web. Now you'll be redirected to your Google Tag Manager workspace where you'll see a code that starts with GTM in the top right corner of your screen. Make sure to copy this code and then log into your Beehive account. Now go to settings, website and analytics and paste in your code where it says Google Tag Manager ID. Now that you've done that, you've deployed Google Tag Manager on your Beehive website and now you can start tracking specific user events like when someone subscribes. Now that you've set up your Google Tag Manager account, is now time to create a custom signup trigger. We basically need to tell the analytics tools that the event we're tracking, a subscription in this case, has occurred. This trigger will help more accurately track signups to your newsletter, which is likely the conversion metric you'll be measuring when you're running your Google Ads. To add a new trigger, click on triggers on the left-hand side of your Tag Manager workspace and click on new in top right of your screen. Now name your trigger. In this case, I'll be calling it subscriber signup. Now click on trigger configuration and scroll down until you see a trigger called custom event under other. For the event name, enter signed up and make sure you type it out exactly as shown on screen right now as it is case sensitive. Now when we're running an ad, we can use this custom event or trigger to track signups. Now it's time to set up a Google Ads conversion event. To set one up, go to ads.google.com and then click on start now. Now log into your Google account or create one if you don't have one yet. Once you're logged in, click on the plus button on the left hand side and then click on conversion action. Now click on website from the list of conversion types and type in your Beehive publications URL. From here, click on scan and apply and then click on add a conversion action manually. Now find and select subscribe from the drop down menu and name this conversion subscribe. Here you can also set the value of this event, but in this case, we'll opt not to set a value. Now click on done, then save and continue. Now click on use Google Tag Manager, and from here, copy the conversion ID and head back to Google Tag Manager. Now click on tags and create a new one. I'll label this tag something like Google Ads Event dash subscribe, and then click on tag configuration. Now click on Google Ads, then Google Ads conversion tracking. Once you've done that, you'll now see a bunch of text fields. For conversion ID, you can paste in the conversion ID you just copied. And for conversion label, you can find that on the Google Ads page you were just on. Just make sure to copy it and paste it in the correct text field in Google Tag Manager. Once you've done that, you might see an error message that says conversion linker tag is missing in container. To fix this, click on create and then click on save, then save again. Now, lastly, click on triggering and select the subscriber signup trigger you made at the beginning of this tutorial. Once you're done, hit save. Finally, you can publish the changes you made to your website by clicking on submit and publish. Now let's actually go set up an ad. This is how it looked like. Go back to Google Ads and click on the plus icon on the left hand side once again, but this time click on campaign. Now from here, click on website traffic from the list of different campaign objectives and under use these conversion goals to improve website traffic, click on add goal and select on the subscribe event you just made. The rest of the campaign is up to you. That's it for this video. You can check out the playlist below if you're interested in setting up subscriber tracking on different platforms like X, Meta, TikTok, and LinkedIn.